It's time to get your risk on. Hello, everybody. Thanks for watching my video. My name is Digitalic, and I'm a Grandmaster ranked online risk player. If you're today, we're back with Mr. Hot Carl for another game of Classic Fixed. Uh, I just want to mention yesterday, I talked about uh, asking people to subscribe to my channel at the beginning of my video yesterday, and people have responded. I've so far received 15 subs off yesterday's video, uh, which is far more than usual that I that I get, uh, and I do I really appreciate it, guys. And again, I promise I will stop begging for subs. I just want to get to that 1,000 mark uh, so I can start getting um, revenue from YouTube so I can reinvest in my channel. Uh, so hit that subscribe button, please, and smash that like button for me. Okay, now let's get into the game of Risk. I am the white player. I'm in the second position. I've got a lot of material in North America, it appears. I also have material in Australia, but you all know how that is going to end. Red also has a lot of material in North America. They do get an extra troop as well. But I think... Don't hit my two, please. Thank you, Orange. Uh, I think I can... I think I can fight red. Oh, green also has material in North America. That kind of sucks. Um, yes, I will accept the alliance request. Oh, do, do, do. I definitely do think we insist on North America and we try and get green to leave. So let's put everything in North America. Let's get a take in Australia while we while we still can with that stack. And let's bring the two in from Kamchatka. Green has a path out. They do have to hit one of my twos. We'll see how it goes. Okay, I do want to take these numbers off because they're a bit distracting. All right, so we're going to watch, see what every player does. And then we'll talk about the settings. I think Black's going to go for Europe. That doesn't surprise me. What does red do? Maybe South America for red? Now green does get two extra troops, so that could be a problem for me. Green can have a decent claim on Australia. Red gonna roll this three. They aren't. They're gonna roll in Africa. And they are they gonna put the stack back on North Africa? Are they gonna no? Are they trying to let me into North America? Okay, I'm not really sure what what Red's doing. It looks like green's gonna go into into Australia. Maybe blue rolls out this three, so I can roll out my three as well again. Oh, they're gonna punch red there. Unnecessarily punch two stack. So I'm gonna say that green is a beginner. Oh, even more unnecessary attacks. Yeah, 4v2 for no reason. That doesn't make sense. Green might even be a novice, but I'll just stick with beginner. I don't usually guess novice because it's really hard to tell the difference between a, between a novice and a beginner because it's you can get to even if you're bad at the game, you can get to beginner really quickly from the novice. You know, you only have to get to a thousand FFA points. <clears throat> All right, we'll see what blue does, and then we'll talk about the settings and the players. So blue insists on Africa. I'm not surprised. They should roll this three out in Australia, in New, New Guinea. No, they roll this one out instead. Oh, that's actually good that they lost that. They rolled a three. Blue's probably a beginner as well. Did they just lose another one? They did. Dude, you got the three in Australia. Oh, and they roll a four. Oh my god, this is awesome. So blue's a beginner. And they connect their stacks in North Africa. Okay, so that was a very violent turn by blue. 
All right, so settings for today's game are world domination, classic map, auto setup, six second turn timer, medium automated bots, fixed cards, balance, blitz, dice, no rank restrictions, alliances are on, but everything else is off, no fogs, blizzards, or portals. In position one, we've got the orange player from Netherlands. It is General Takamoto. Uh, position two is myself, if anything goes account, currently ranks the Grand Master. Position three, we have the black player is General Bo from USA. Position four, we've got the red player from uh, Vietnam, I think. That's Shaylee Bianchi. Uh, position five, we've got the green player from Argentina, General Hase. And in sixth position, we've got the blue player from what appears to be Australia or one of the Australian colonies. Oh, is Orange looking to come into USA? Orange just pointed at me. And that's Ada Wild. Okay, so let's do this. Everything in North America. Let's roll this three out. We lose it, unfortunately. Uh, let's roll down this way then. And let's bring this two onto this three. That wasn't the greatest turn. So black gonna pull the four in. Yeah, black is all in on the on the Europe play, which I'm happy about. They can Okay, roll it looks like they're gonna take it pretty aggressively. Okay, cool. I should probably ask the black player for an alliance. Cool. And I get it. So let's send them a thumbs up. It's kind of all over the place now. Let's see what the green player does. Hopefully they roll blues three before mine. Okay, they're putting it. They're putting troops in North America, which I don't like. Maybe the three rolls onto the two, or fortifies onto the two. Okay, I can deal with that. <coughs> Maybe Red wants to get their four down to South America? I can oblige. Okay, Blue's putting material in Africa. They're probably going to finish it now. I really wish they would roll out the three in Australia. That would be doing be doing me a huge favor, but this game... Oh, God. They roll, lose a four V2. Brutal. Blue is just getting crushed by the dice. Okay, we're going to continue. Do they split back and take the one in Egypt and finish the continent? Yes, it looks like they're going to. Very good. Okay. But they still leave my three jammed in Australia. Okay. Where is orange going? Are they? They're coming into North America, aren't they? Oh, well, they're definitely only pointed at me there, which I don't like. Don't like one bit. They think I'm going into South America, but I'm not. A set would be nice. It's always nice to get a set on three and oh, nice and classic fixed. A very very powerful set to get. 
The block's going to finish Europe. And it looks like they're not going to mess with the blue player. Maybe the blue player, since I think they're a beginner, are going to mess with them. But we'll find out. Oh my god, red immediately breaks blue. Oh my god, they roll a 6 on 4. The blue player is almost dead. Oh, they roll a 5 on 3. Red's a beginner. The 3v2, why not? You may as well roll it now, eh? Oh, this is just getting ugly. What an ugly turn of events. What an ugly, ugly turn of events. Now, if green got that four out of the way, I could almost kill black. I feel like the black player is my strongest opponent. Almost kill black. Blue's gonna roll the four v two. No, blue's gonna go into survival mode. Now, if black had an extra card here, orange has a 10 trade. Let's hope they don't come in and hit me. Are they going to try and kill blue? That would be a mistake, I think. Can I kill blue and red? Who would be first? Now, see, that's the problem here. The problem is this, this two here is a big problem. I think I set up for it and hope neither of them trade. So I'm just going to take a hit off of green and then go back into this position here. Oh, I guess I can't really set up for it because I still have the problem of that two in the way. Black didn't trade, but I don't have the power to kill them unless I get a god roll. Oh, red traded. That's not good. They're going to kill the blue player. Okay. They are going to kill the blue. They can't even kill the blue player, though. They can, they're going to feed the blue kill to green. <laughs> Very interesting. They're going to feed the, green, the blue kill to green, and that will set green in. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. green sets first. So green sets and gets three free cards. 
for doing almost nothing. I'm looking like I can get a perfect roll on it. Hmm. I didn't roll my three. Very interesting. Okay, I need to stack in this game. I'd love to kill Black here, but I just don't quite have the troop power for it. I would love to kill Black. So I don't think that's in the cards. Weird. <clears throat> Orange is a strange player. I'm going to give them intermediate. I think that's a I think that might be being generous. Hmm. Yeah, 29 to kill 29 troops. That would be something. It's my last... Okay, so anyway, let's just... Oh, we lose that 3v1. That sucks. Uh... I want stack mobility, so I'm going to hit this green territory here and stick. I didn't like losing that 3v1. That, that, that wasn't fun. Okay. So I can no longer kill black. It's not an option. Cool, so Black just takes a card in North America and goes back to their central guard. I guess I'm okay to take North America now. Red doesn't finish. Okay, I need an alliance with Red. <clears throat> In the lines of green as well. What orange is doing, I don't get. I don't understand what the orange player is doing. <clears throat> oh. Okay. Green did not like Orange's presence in Asia, so they rolled out a big stack, and Orange just completely rolls out their army. I like that. So I can. T I think I take North America in on the next turn. Hope to get a set on three. What a strange move by Green. All right, let's take North America. We need we need production. This game might not be a, a killing spree.
Okay, and we'll have no militarized border with block. Let's see if block lets me hold. Oh, I got an artillery set. <laughs> okay, Black and I are homies. I can I can appreciate that. Red doesn't want to take Africa. I think that's a mistake. I think the board will allow it. What Orange's next move is beyond me. They're pointed at me if they have a trade and they just want to hit me. And they can certainly can do that. Uh, so I really kind of need to survive with my continent intact and 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 get my opportunity to tr to, tr to trade that big trade. I wonder if green's gonna hit orange again. Green's gonna hit someone. You don't just come out like that if you're not gonna hit. Come on. You got this. Nope, nothing. And back to Siam without having taken their bonus. What is green doing? I think black is an expert. And those are my guesses. Okay, and orange points at green, which I like. Okay. Do we trade? Black can't hit me. Orange can't hit me. Attack red, bruh. Well, I'm definitely not going to listen to you. So I'm almost wondering. If orange doesn't trade. If green doesn't trade and if red doesn't trade. We might have a chain opportunity here. And then, then, a, then, a, then a trap block in Europe. But that's pretty unlikely. Most likely orange will trade. Though if orange trades and they do something like they move into... Green. Okay, so red traded. So the the full there is no full chain for sure. And red takes Africa. They punch out into the mid east. Okay, interesting move. Let's see what green does. Green should take Australia. They should have taken Australia four turns ago, I think. <laughs> okay, so we see a lot of trading.
breaking. Me too. Yeah, I'm gonna get broken as well. Okay, that's interesting. Now, if the orange doesn't trade, and if orange punches green here, that would be fantastic for me. Because I could kill both of them. Well, I mean, green isn't really worth it, but I could... I have to do something, though. All right, five cards for 31 troops. It's not troop positive. Um, and I think I keep orange in the game. Plus two in Northwest Territories. So we'll just get a take off of green. I won't retake my 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 continent yet. Green still hasn't taken Australia. I left these here too because I think green will, will break red. Oh, shit. Now, if I knew black was going to do this, I definitely would have killed orange for the cards. Interesting, black's going to have five cards. I can't actually kill green, but red can. Weird. Green's going to try and break black again? No. Let's see what orange does. Orange should take Australia.
we're just gonna kill green. Interesting. It's gonna leave orange with five cards. 41 troops. Hmm. Kill black. Trade. I can also go into Australia. Nah, I don't even want to go into Australia. Don't even want to. Big trade, nice. See what the red player does. I think I just stack here. Does red break black? I just kill block here. Be a really, really bold play. I think I don't. I think I chill. Someone's at the door.
Okay. Sorry, my gardening. Sorry, my gardener was messaging me. Okay, so orange is attacking red. That's good. Gonna take card and pass. Set. Nope. Maybe red goes full tilt on orange. Looks like they're going to. Breaking black in the same in the meantime. They hit big stacks. Okay, so orange can't attack back because they, they lock their stack. They certainly can do that in a later turn. Does orange point their stack at red? They don't. They stay locked. I'm not going to unlock Black's Australia stack. And I'll continue to take cards. Black opens up their army in Australia. <coughs> Red should just take take South America back. Or actually, just leave it as is. Because now you've reopened Orange. Black is preparing to kill me. Orange doesn't trade and they smack that stack. We go on a killing spree. Do it, Orange. Hit it. Oh, they're not going to. Damn. 
They're just gonna match. I don't have a trade. Buddy, if you're not attacking red, I'm not attacking red. Ooh, black's attacking red. Interesting. Interesting. Black has five cards. What does red do? Red slams into black. That's good for me. It doesn't look like they're going to. should though cuz that would be awesome for me Okay so I leave this alone I leave this alone I sit back and then do nothing I kind of wish red had a little bit more time. Orange sets. Yeah, I don't mess with black here. I don't take Australia. Orange opens up the road for black to hit them. I have a plus two in Kamchatka, or do I want Mongolia? Let's do that. Bro, I ain't attacking nobody. Let's see what black does. Black retakes and hits red. gets off of Orange's border. Let's see if red breaks black again. Well, 6v4. Maybe the waters have calmed. Do I have a trade? I do.
I think I I think I take Australia. Definitely an interesting game. Red just passes on a card. Very interesting. Very interesting. I'm not going to get a card here, because I, I, I actually want to bring these together. I don't want to leave a three out. Okay, black hits red again. Very, very interesting. Is red going to roll black's 20? Ooh. We'll have to break orange to get a card.
So that opens orange's stack, unfortunately. So I think red's gonna go suicide into black. Okay, so orange kills red. I think, right? Maybe they leave their stack trapped? Come on. Hit black. do leave their strap their stack trapped so they do have four cards though there's so that to remember Okay. You get a four trade. That will not get them a card. I have a trade, I'm in a good spot, I do. So we gotta work quickly here. You know what? I think here I just zero this out. If we roll at zero. And we pull this here in. That won't give him a trade either. <laughs> Beautiful end game. They're getting good dice. 
That's not good. Even if they get a card, I still have the win. Oh, they're getting fantastic dice. Oh my god. It's over anyway, because I have a trade. Oh my god. Absolute god dice. They should have blitzed by now. Oh my god, this is the best dice I've ever seen. Now they can actually break me. That's crazy. They better go. They better hurry, though. They better break Asia. But I think that's it. Good game. Well played. I didn't actually mean to do that laugh emote, but I got it in there. Okay, so, very interesting game. Um, I have green as a beginner, I have blue as a beginner, I have red as a beginner, I have orange as an intermediate, and I have black as an expert. Let's see how I did. Okay, black was a novice, not an expert, I was way off. Uh, orange, I said intermediate, I was correct. Uh, red, I said beginner, they're a novice, close enough. Uh, green, I said beginner, I was correct. Uh, blue, I said beginner, and they I was correct again. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. I know it was a bit uh, of an unorthodox play for me just to start single stacking in Asia, but this is just when I when I read skill, I just it's just my read on the board is that just stuff like this is going to go down, and an opportunity will arise where I can use use the math. And the opportunity was that Orange locked their stack in 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 um in South America. And then they made the mistake of only fortifying half their stack off. They should have fortified the whole thing. But I still think at that point I would have won because I could have just rolled their stack down. Um, but we'll see. All right, guys, if you like the video, please smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider doing so. Help me get to 1,000 subs so I can get paid for my work. Um, follow me on Twitch. The link's in the description. And until I see you next time, you keep fighting that good fight.